the great steel city of Pittsburgh to watch the high-flying Stanley Cup winning Penguins. Hi everyone, along with Eddie Olchek, and you'll hear and see Ray Ferraro in just a moment. And I'm Mike Emmerich, and we are tonight seeing a team that is on a bit of a downside. They have not been able to win consistently lately. Take us inside that locker room. What's it like? Well, you got to try to find some confidence, Doc, right now, because you are shaking. The pressure is on you. Your fans are on you. The media is on you. Your coach is probably all over you. But I think more than anything else, it's a mindset. Is let's not really try to worry about winning the game because that is the end result, and we know that. But let's win the first period and see where we are after the first period of play. The Golden Knights find themselves on a losing streak as of late, but they have been doing some good things. It's just a matter of time before they are rewarded for all their hard work. Maybe it's tonight. We direct our attention to the Nets and the starting goalies. Coming off a victory, he gets the start tonight. Malcolm Subban. There is a benefit of being claimed on waivers. A first-round choice of Boston in 2012 only got in two appearances for him, most of the time in the AHL, and then came Vegas and Opportunity. Sidney Crosby. I don't know. How about the only player in history to win the Stanley Cup, Olympic gold, World Championship gold, World Junior gold, the heart, and the MVP in the Stanley Cup playoffs in the World Cup of Hockey. We've got more, but we got to play. Play is stopped, so let's hear from our man at the ice, Ray Ferraro. It's like a little trailer to a movie when you watch East vs. West. You get a little bit of what could be a smorgasbord, which is the Stanley Cup final. Many thanks, Ray. The Golden Knights with a clean win on the draw. Cuts off that pass on the attack. Reads the play and keeps it. And now it's directed to Pacioretty. Trying to go to McNabb. It's an onside play. Stole that pass away in his own end. And he gains the zone. Let's it go. Score! He got the post with that one. Sometimes when you score first, you take the edge off your own team. That can't happen. You're up one, go make it two. The Penguins now have a one goal lead in the first period. Perhaps they can build on this and carry something sizable to the dressing room. It's dropped, they lock up, and that's a good shot by the wingers. Passing one off now to Carlson. And angled to McNabb. Two minutes, 29 seconds. Right to the point. Save. It'll come free, but not without a lot of work. The Penguins with possession in the neutral zone. Driving in from no man's land. Takes that pass. Setting it up. Presses that attack. Pass across at the point. They're getting ready to strike. Threatening an attack. Possession in the zone. Collected in the corner. Back at the point now. Sends a howitzer. Goes for it. Had it away. Collected in the corner. Looks to make a play. Didn't have time, but he saved it anyway. The shooter thought he had a chance, but the goaltender robs him. What a stop. Located beneath the stadium. They win the draw. What next? From the outside. Save there. Pittsburgh's lugging it along in the defensive zone. On to Hagelin. A rocket. Can't get it on net. That puck's loose. He couldn't get through the roadblock. Solid work there by Smith. Bangs it ahead to Tuck. Propelled to Brassard. And that pass is a mess, and so they're going to have to go back out. 
One of the great things about this sport is watching two big guys collide. He was looking to finish his check, and he lines up his man right up against the board. They can't find the target. If you don't hit the net, you can't score. Give yourself a chance by getting it on the net. Poked away wonderfully by Hagelin. Cuts off that pass in the attacking zone. Got in front of another one. The goalie makes himself look big. Tripped up on the play, and there will be a penalty. The Penguins get a two-minute penalty for tripping. Oh, this is clearly a tripping call. He made no attempt to play the puck and took the legs out from the attacking player. The Golden Knights are going on their first power play opportunity of the game. Oh, you get your power play on the ice for the first time. You can really generate some momentum, whether you score or not. Have a positive power play. 12 minutes, 44 seconds. Over seven minutes to go here in the first. Pittsburgh's got the lead, 1-0. The Penguins with a face-off win. Cleared back out again, and so the power play unit has to drop back. Gathered up by Sidney Crosby. Pass attempt to Holland. He's got that pass at the point. Wonderful save on a terrific scoring chance. You got to battle through a screenplay. Shoots one. Terrific shot block in the lane. Back to the blue line. Oh, my, what a hit. Crosby's not strictly a finesse player. He uses the body to his advantage quite frequently. Point to point pass. Fires in front. Oh, and it's off the mark. That's a good scoring chance. He's trying to be too fine, trying to pick the corner. Sometimes you've just got to shoot it at the middle of the net. Covered up, just to slow things down. We get new styles of jerseys, shirts, hats, and more in our team store. The Penguins bench really got excited when they saw their goaltender make that amazing stop. Clean win on the draw. Pittsburgh's gotten it back out. They check the clock, get ready to defend. Directing that one to Carlson. Played on to Pacioretty. A slot wrister. Save. Trying to get it back out of the zone. Cleared it out of there. He's roaming from the crease and looking. Pitching it to Carlson. Oh, what a hit that one was. And he's got to pick himself up, and then he's got to go find his stick. That was a big hit. He cleared that puck out of there. Outstanding body contact. That one is pointed to him. Fires. Outstanding save. Oh, they had a great chance. A desperate clear back down, and that gives them the time they need. A player change coming up for the Penguins. Subban's at the bench. The extra man's on. Vegas lost a genuine chance to tie this game with the man advantage. They could not do it. The Penguins get a minor penalty for charging. Well, too many strides taking while making contact and getting the minor penalty. The Golden Knights power play gets another chance to operate. Hasn't been effective yet. After an ineffective power play earlier in the game, Let's see if they can get a little more organized at the puck into the zone and get it on net far more frequently. Cleared out of the zone. They get ready for another attack on this power play. Trying to clear the zone. Terrific determination by Smith. His next goal will be a special one. He's got friends in the stands hoping to see it. Clears the zone. They must retreat and start back again. Looking to Smith. What a heavy hit. Trying to relieve some of the pressure. He got rid of it. Snapping a pass to McNabb. A big hit in open ice. Another reason to like this game tonight. Slid the Holland. Got his pad on a changing shot. Cleared it back out of there. Skates it into the zone. Stole that pass at a critical end of the ice. That one's fired back out, and so more time will go off the penalty clock. 
Puck is thrown to Schmidt. And the players collide in open ice. Open ice hits are hard to execute. If your timing's off just a little bit, you're going to miss them or end up taking a tripping penalty. He finally got it out of there. Moving it to Pacioretty. A huge open ice hit. Strong, slippery move. Back to the point. Changes the angle. And a save. Gathered up again by Miller. Gains that offensive line. Made that stop. Tries to get it over the line. Vegas failed to take advantage on the power play. They might regret this one. Frustration starts to seep in here, guys, when you miss a power play at a key juncture of the game like that. This is a chance to tie the game. They don't execute it very well. Say. Hangs on to that one for a stoppage in front. Subban's save here is one of the easier ones he's had tonight. A stick save that he can make all day. Defensive zone win. Angles it ahead to Belmont. Cut off that pass. Pittsburgh's forced another turnover in this very close game. Looks ahead to start something. Pitching this one to Aiken. Chip to Gensel. Leads that charge into the zone. Let's it go. Outstanding save. Just on reputation, you can smell a goal there. Twenty minutes are in the books, and so the coaches will have their say. The players will rest and listen. Pittsburgh's connected once, and that's the only goal. We turn to the shots on goal. Heavy for one, light for the other. A gaudy 14 for Vegas and six for the Penguins. Kessel's goal was pretty good, but is it the difference maker? It is for right now. We had to break. First period has been played, second period about to start. A look ahead. The Golden Knights are down only by one, Doc, and they're lucky. The way they turned over the puck in that first period, this could easily be a three or four goal deficit. Period two has started. Wonder if it'll be like the first one. On to Kessel. Wonderful stop. What a ripper. That puck struck him in front. To Kessel. Rockets one. Lightning in that glove. And now it's directed to Pacioretty. Is able to move on in. Let's it go. Terrific save with no reaction time whatsoever. The goaltender shuts that one down and a superb opportunity. Score! Crosby! shot was really hard, Doc, but where he put it was more impressive to me. He's got enough time to lay into the slap shot here. He powders this, and the goalie doesn't even see it. The Penguins have built a two-goal lead now. Perhaps on this faceoff, they can make it three before the end of the second period, at least. And they've won the neutral zone faceoff. Picks it up back there. Tremendous hit. Oh, he's been looking for that hit all night. Time of the goal, two minutes, 52 seconds. They've got the draw. Can start the attack going in the zone. A one-timer, he will score! And it's a one-goal game.
worked himself into a good scoring area and let it go on the backhand. I love scoring these goals. You'd score over the goalie's glove and you'd say if you're looking for it, it's behind you. The Golden Knights have gotten back to within one. Loads of time left in the game. We're in the second period. A face-off win. Let's see what develops. Scored by number 81. Trying to go to Hallman. In between the blue lines, a great job on the cut pass by Malkin. A shot. He caught it and he holds on. A delayed penalty call. Passing one off now to Schmidt. And the goalie to the bench. The extra man's on. Airborne to Miller. Stood his ground and blocked that shot. Let's it rip. Great save. They keep applying the pressure. Good territorial play for them here. The Penguins get two minutes up on the penalty clock for interference. You cannot stop his progress in this particular play. You have to allow him the ability to be able to move up the ice interference. They move the puck around beautifully on a power play. Just nothing to show for it. I sure agree, Eddie. Well, their power play hasn't come through for them yet. There's another opportunity. See if they can take advantage of it. Six minutes, 49 seconds. The power play unit has to recoil and try yet again. Pass attempt to Miller. Steps in from the neutral zone. In their own end, skating with it. Directing that one to Brassard. He throws it there. Nice save there. They're going to have to do better than that to beat him. Snatches it up. The Penguins force another turnover in this game. Let's see what they can do with it. What a save. That great save was all positioning. Goalies have to make a half a dozen great stops in a win. This is one on a beautiful move, but there is nowhere for the puck to go. Murray's seen a lot of rubber tonight. His team defensively hasn't helped him out very much, but he's turned aside almost everything, and as a result, they have the lead. Pitching it to Miller, looking to Pacioretty. It's one of those rare games where there's not much scoring, but there's been plenty of chances. The goaltenders have been excellent, and the energy has been high. Snapping a pass to Rust. Terrific save, terrific opportunity. You can't deliver the puck much better than that, but the goalie says no chance. That's an excellent save. A little under eight minutes have transpired. They have scored, and so maybe there's momentum here. Solid win of the draw. Deflected off the blocker. And so that one is cleared, and they check the clock and get ready for more. Big point blank save there. A timely save. That is tremendously tremendous. Puck is thrown to Halla. Shoots one just wide. Propelled to Smith. Directed on. Sticked away. Oh, that was hard to follow. Still time on this power play, but not much. Got that pass in his own end. Gets it out. Moving it to Stastny. Gains the zone. Shoots one. That went off the pass. Shot. And still another save. What a show. Goalies have to make a half a dozen great stops in a win. This is one on a beautiful move, but there is nowhere for the puck to go. Vegas could not take advantage at a key point in the game. Power play over. They have enough power plays to evaluate the people that they've had on the ice. Maybe they just don't have enough skill to be successful. They get chances, but they just can't finish them off. Nice face-off work. Pitching this one to Malkin. Gains the blue line. Missed the puck on the shot attempt.
intercepts that pass. Maybe he can generate something. Skill play by Carlson. Tries to get it on net. Got a piece of that one. And now it's directed to Brassard. Laid on to Johnson. Sticked away. Oh, that was hard to follow. And decides to just hold on and get a stop to play. A little under eight minutes to be played here in the second. The Penguins with a narrow lead of two to one. Puck drop, face off one, and the winger stepped right in. Carries it on in from center. Muscled off. Fires, save! Just inside the line. That's a good save and goal. They're going to have to come up with something better than that. You're not going to beat a goaltender of this caliber with that shot. That's a pretty easy blocker stop. Good help for the centerman. The Golden Knights skated up on the side. And he dumps it in. Pittsburgh's got it in their own end, hoping for center. Stastny's tripped up. That should be a penalty. Mata's going to the box. It's a tripping minor. This is an easy call for the official, Doc. Player made no attempt to play the puck and just tripped up the attacking player. There is hope with every man advantage, even if your percentage is poor. Are you listening? Well, you're not going to get an endless supply of power plays, but they get another one here. See if they can punch through. A superb hit. A great hockey play there. When you step up like that, that stops all momentum through the middle of the ice. Scooped up by Smith. And down to Hall. What a tremendous hit. The penalty killers have struck again, getting rid of it out of their own end. Has that point pass as well. Marvelous save. No time on that one. You talk about cutting down the angle. Perfectly executed by the goaltender. That shot came from right in front. You can't deliver the puck much better than that, but the goalie says no chance. That's an excellent save. Good job on the draw. The Penguins shoot it back out. Got some time to check the clock and prepare to defend again. There's a delayed penalty on this play. Slid to Smith. Here it comes. Whistle is blown. Now the penalty will be handed out. The Penguins lose one guy off their roster for this one. It's a game misconduct. Every game presents a fork in the road opportunity, and this is it. It's a long five on three power play, and it begins now. Oh, man, he's got to learn to stay out of the penalty box. You're not going to be in the league long if you continue to take penalties. Pittsburgh's cleared. A lot of work, but penalty time less and less now. Rister, he scores! Special team, a special goal. this game up and still lots of playing time left we're late in the second and the faceoffs won steps across that line a big big hit Pacioretty's often the focus of other teams physical play he's gonna have to pick himself up after he got trucked there couldn't get it out 
puck picked up here. Took that puck behind the net. He takes that point pass. Shoots. Gets it with the blocker. Back at the point now. Out to the point. Big takeaway. Tries to clear. And the penalty killers come up big again. It's clear. McNabb's got it in the defensive zone, headed to center. In with it now. Let's it go. The shot is off. We sometimes forget the speeds these guys are playing at, but accuracy is a key in creating chances. The arm is up of the referee. There will be a penalty coming up, but the whistle hasn't blown yet. And this penalty will wipe out the power play. Pacioretty's got a minor penalty here for interference. You got to play with controlled emotion. You can't run around and hit everybody, especially when they don't have the puck. The teams will go four on four. Do you take risks offensively, or do you just play defense and limit Vegas mistakes? I hope the they take chances myself. The open ice leads to some great scoring chances four on four. You get a defenseman into the rush. If you don't score, the other team's guaranteed a two on one going back the other way. The stick can break up a play, and it just did. Save there. In that defensive zone, an important play. Odd man rush, two on one. Oh, that's a brilliant play by the defense. And he's hit again. He'll feel that one tomorrow. He scores! Three straight goals. Oh, you knew this goal was going to be huge. This game has been tied and hard fought. The Golden Knights have taken a late second period lead in this one. That might change the conversation in the locker room at the Horn. The Penguins got that faceoff win. Now what? Scored by number 71, William Carlson. Assisted by number 27, Eddie picks it up. That puck's lose a good defensive play. Blue line control. Moves it to the corner. Pittsburgh's leaving the defensive zone. Shoots it off. Snapped out of the air. Players tired, about to get a rest. Seconds to play here, still in the second period. Last minute of play. Swipe that one at center ice. And he's tripped, and there'll be a penalty. And now we'll get the penalty call. Vegas gets a tripping minor. I'm going to give credit to the puck carry here. He kept his legs moving. He forced the back checker to reach in and take him off his feet. The Penguins have an extra man. Still lots of open ice at four on three. Always important to win the special teams battle, or at the very least, come out even. Terrific glove save. Trying to go to Malkin. Perfect Brister. Outstanding save off a chance. And that one cleared by the penalty killers. Pittsburgh's in their own end, hoping to make a play to center. The Penguins' power play let him down at a very important time. Score! And the game is even. That's a big goal there for them to score. They can go into the locker room feeling pretty good about themselves. The Penguins have fought their way back into this, getting it tied before the end of the second period. Coach's words in the intermission, and an exciting third lies ahead. By number 87, Sidney Crosby, assisted by number Intercepted that one at an important place. Time of the goal, 19 minutes. Open ice hitting is back. Unfortunately, the puck carrier there knows he's in a hockey game. 
Wow, what a collision. Lifts one. Oh, what a glove he's got there. Never satisfied. Never take your foot off the gas pedal. He's got two goals now. He better be thinking about getting number three. Two periods are in the books here, and so one more to go, and maybe overtime, but it's been an entertaining first two. As is our custom, we look now at the shots on goal. Wow, does anybody play defense here? 34 for Vegas, and 21 for the Penguins. Crosby's goal, shown again here, has knotted this game up. It came late in the period. Maybe more in store next period. Intermission is next. Forty minutes have been played. They are getting ready for the third period here. So take us back through the game. What do you think, Eddie? Pittsburgh's got a great chance to win this game, Doc, if they stay out of the penalty box. You cannot continue to rely on your penalty killers, especially in the late minutes of a hockey game. Underway in the third period in a tie contest, even in goals, pretty even in play, it seems. Takes it in from the neutral zone. Alone. Great save, shutting down one of the best. And yet another save. Score! Excited here. They've broken the tie. They've got the lead. But now you have to concentrate and get right back down to work. The Golden Knights have gotten a one goal lead here in the third period. Do they go for two or do they just try to protect this? Neutralized face off win. Crosses that line. Cuts off the passing lane in the defensive zone. And by number 30. Didn't get any of it. A strong pad stop there. To McNabb. Chip to Schmidt. That is up close and personal. You come through that area of the ice, somebody's looking to light you up. Shoots. Wonderful stop. That was a good challenge. Better stop. Vegas had an earlier power play goal. Not this time. Passing one off now to Theodore. Perfectly on his stick in that pass from the left wing. And he steps across the line. That puck's loose because of the defense. Brings it in for an attack. Very important steal for him. Pass attempt to Malkin. That pass is cut. Let's a shot go. And a save. It is hard work here to get the puck free. Things are heating up with that hit. The Golden Knights hopefully shifting from defense to offense in their own end. Back in his defensive end to get it. Near the boards. Shoot. Score! And this one is tied. This game's not going to spread out. That goal ties it. The teams are so evenly matched. The Penguins have gotten this game back even, so maybe we will have the dramatic finish that we all anticipate when we walked in the doors tonight. They lock up from the draw, and the teammate puts the grab on it. Directing that one to Engelin. Pitching it to Smith. Breaks away. Save! Shut down the best guy the other team had. Quick wrist shot. Robbery there. That 
Buck came back to center ice, and so everything slows down for just a bit. He works it along with a pass off the board. That's somebody that's been around. He took a quick look up the middle of the ice, nothing there, so he banks it off the boards to his partner, and out of the zone they go. Well, you know he's happy, guys. He's sitting there on the bench. He's got a couple of goals in his back pocket already. But you know he's thinking about number three. What an achievement that would be to bang in one more. Just under nine minutes played here in the third. The winds have shifted yet again. This is going to be an interesting third period. Look at this chance. They score. What a quick answer to that one. dangerous once you break a tie that you would sit back and try to protect the lead. I think you have to stay aggressive and play in the other end. Vegas now leads this game by one, breaking the tie here in the third period. Neutral zone face off one. Possession established here. Marvelous defensive play. What a gem that was. To the point it comes. Enormous hit. I like that he's trying to create space by throwing the body around. This is a way to change momentum in a hockey game. Shot. Wonderful save. What skill by both goalie and shooter. You got to find a way to put it in the net. Up that right side to Rust. World class deep there. Cut that pass in his own end. Broke it up. The Penguins keep the play going in the middle. To Carlson. Carlson's effort on that last goal was unbelievable. He's got that point pass. Good intercept in his own end. That's a bad turnover, Doc. When you're ahead, that puck has to be moved into a safe area of the ice 100% of the time. Crosby's back on the ice. He just hopped over the boards. He's been all over the ice and the score sheet. Merrill's injury occurs on this play. You can hear the collision from where I'm standing. A bit over five minutes remaining here in the period. We've got a leader in this game now. Maybe it'll be tied up again, though. Good face-off win. Oh, that one hit someone on the way. Pittsburgh's winging it at neutral ice. And there's a delayed penalty call. Dogged determination there by Miller. Malkins headed to the penalty box. A minor for tripping. Now oh, this is a tough call. He was trying to play the puck, but he tripped up the attacking player. Every game presents a fork in the road opportunity, and this is it. It's a long five-on-three power play, and it begins now. You don't get too many chances like this, Doc. A five-on-three power play. The key is to be aggressive, get the puck to the net, make those three penalty killers move all over the place. That puck hit him on the way to the net. Two guys together with force, big force. That's what we call, Doc, using the old noggin. What a hit that was! He's got such a narrow focus here. He wants to give his team a spark physically to get them back into the game where they can try and level this out. Gains the zone and looks over his options. Not a hard hit, but effective. The Penguins in their own end lug that puck along. And the pickup. That pass along the boards. Shot on. No! You score on that chance, that gives you some breathing room the rest of the way. Elevates a pass to Stastny. Oh, what a save that was. Pittsburgh's been outplayed for most of this night, but their goaltender has kept them in it. He's been exceptional throughout. Well, in desperation mode, all he was trying to do was sweep the puck away, but unfortunately caught the player's skates. 
It's a five on three. It's a power play and it's a chance to do some damage. They've already had some success on the power play with a power play goal earlier in the game. They don't have to change much. Make sure you move the puck quickly and get traffic to the front of the net. Gets that pass in the corner. Oh, snaps the shot. Terrific shot, but a denial. To Pacioretty. Wow, what a glove save. Try to clear the puck. And the penalty killers come up big again. It's cleared. In all alone. Save. Couldn't have handpicked a better guy to be on a breakaway, and he stopped him. A huge save late in the game. The Canadians are always a difficult team to play against, Doc, and they're up next on the schedule. They'll need to get a lot of pucks at the net early in this next one. Get some big hits as well, and do anything to set the tone in their favor. That didn't go like he wanted. Shoots one. The Golden Knights are moving the puck in the defensive zone. Carlson's tripped and a penalty should be coming. The Tang's going to the box and the call is tripping. He's got great stick positioning. Stick is on the ice, but unfortunately takes the skates out from under him. Every game presents a fork in the road opportunity, and this is it. It's a long five on three power play, and it begins now. You're right, Doc. This is a big advantage here. A five on three on the power play. It's one you have to capitalize on. A huge faceoff win at a critical point here. Cranks a blast! The Penguins skated up on the side. Let's it go. Outstanding glove save. That's a great face-off win. Vegas motors ahead. Enormous hit. He's crushed. Oh, that is a great hit. I love that hit. In the open ice, you really send a message with one of those. Smith's shaking up, Doc. That was a bone rattler. Oh, man, he gets crushed here. That does not feel very good, even from where I'm standing. They won that faceoff. Can they clear it? Strong play there. Man, oh man, what a hit. <laughs> what a collision in open ice. And ripped to Schmidt. Did not get anything up. Right at 60 to go. A wild finish ahead. Took that right away. Well, with all my years involved in a game, I would anticipate there's going to be a little bit of payback after that big open ice hit. An enormous defensive faceoff win. Big collision in open ice. Just like shootout. Comes up big on the breakaway. The Golden Knights want to generate something up the wing. On to Pacioretty. What a save, considering the shooter that's usually in. Goalies have to make a half a dozen great stops in a win. This is one on a beautiful move, but there is nowhere for the puck to go. What can they do now that they've won it? And snap to Theodore. Oh, look at this! Score! What a power play these guys have.
see if they can continue the momentum gained with this power play goal as they head out for the next shift. They take that neutral zone face off. Oh, did he ever get hit? I don't know how many times that is tonight, but he's been targeted. Quick wrister. Save. Pittsburgh's in their own end and on the move. Goalie's one of the six guys on the ice. He can pass. He did that. Cut that pass in his own end. They've been so responsible with the puck most of the night. It's plays like that that they just haven't made. This isn't the time to start being risky. There can only be one that is the first, and this is it. Victory number one. Not many people make it to this level, and he's now proven he can succeed here as well. His first National Hockey League win. That's it for another great night at a hockey rink. For Eddie and Ray, Doc saying good evening, everyone.